Good morning. Hello, how are you? I'm wonderful. Thank you so much for asking. Would you do us the honor of introducing yourself and telling us what you do? Yeah, uh, Nate Westry with Nexus 6 Marketing in West Des Moines, Iowa. Um, I'm the VP of Sales and uh, a little bit of everything else. Uh, we're a pretty, pretty small firm, and so we all wear a lot of hats. Wow. Tell us more about one of these hats that you wear. Yeah. Um, a lot of what we do is uh, just going out and meeting real people. Mm -hmm. um, we spent a lot of time this week talking about uh, scaling and automation and AI and letting computers kind of decide things for us. Mm -hmm we try to really focus on the people, like the real people at the end of the line. Uh, and so I think that's helped kind of set us apart from some of the other agencies in town and, and really around anywhere. Fantastic. And I think that part is really important. It, it gets left out a lot. We mm -hmm. People work with big companies and they get lost in numbers, I think sometimes. Mm -hmm. And I just, at, at the end of the day, we have to realize that that's a real person at the other end, whether they're buying one of our services or our client services or products, and mm -hmm. that's where we try to focus. Amazing. Now, how did you get started in this field? I've been in sales and marketing forever. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, even started back mowing lawns and shoveling snow. Um, worked in a grocery store and restaurants. Uh, I owned a bar and grill for 10 years, and that's, I think, where the personal branding and and telling your story became really apparent that that's how things go. And through a couple of other um, maybe failed uh, <laughs> adventures, um, I ended up with Nexus 6 about a year ago, and uh, it's, it's been a really good match. Uh, we, we see things on, on the same level, and again, I think at the end of the day, we, we both know that taking care of the customer has to be number one. And this really helps us understand why you all are winning this award recognition this week. How does it feel to be seen and celebrated? Oh, fantastic. Um, you know, not to ever toot our own horn, but it, it is nice to be, to be recognized and, and have people say, we really like what you're doing. Um, that's really how we measure things. Again, with marketing, you can make numbers say whatever you want. Um, but if our customers like us and enjoy working with us, and ultimately they're making more money because they're working with us, that's our goal and that's, that's what we wanna do. Your passion and dedication to really serving the highest needs of your customers is evident as you speak. Well, thank you. Um, again, I think having owned my own bar and grill and, and doing that for 10 years, I very uniquely understand what a lot of other small business owners are dealing with. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of those just day-to-day -day struggles that again, can kind of get lost when you're looking only at at numbers mm -hmm. and so yes I hope that, that at the end of the day again uh, you know the customers see that and they know that I am on their side because if they're not doing well then we're not doing well phenomenal tell us a little bit what your Marsum conference experience has been like for you fantastic um, I've learned a ton this week um, just had this conversation a little bit ago that there are so many avenues of marketing and some people focus on Facebook ads and some on SEO, and it's really hard to do all of the things that you can do that kind of fall under the umbrella of marketing. Uh, so we've made some really good connections uh, here, and I think the, the partnerships and collaborations that, that we'll be able to do moving forward, even above what we've been doing already, I think are gonna be invaluable, not just to us, but to our end clients too. Absolutely. We're delighted to hear that this networking is taking place like magic and you're enjoying the synergy of this space. Uh, if you had a moment, would you like to express any gratitude or honor anyone in this moment of now? Yeah, absolutely. Um, family, for sure. Um, everybody's been very supportive. Um, I've jumped a couple jobs again here lately after, after I sold my, my restaurant. Uh, it took a minute to find, find my new home base. Mm -hmm. And uh, you know, the people that have kind of helped me out and, and got me here have been phenomenal. Um, my two-year-old son. <laughs> What's his name? Sterling. Is Sterling here with you today? No. <laughs> no, he's back in Iowa. But he's in your heart. So it sounds like you do this for him. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to tell our story so that, uh, yeah, there's something good for him to come into. 
That's beautiful. Well, you are a phenomenal dad, partner. You are celebrated and seen, and you are worthy of all these good feelings. Thank you. We, we hope to see you again next year. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. My pleasure.